There this morning in the Mobile Weather Center. Leslie, talk a little bit about the uh, row construction you're going through there in the Triangle area this morning. Uh, yeah, we're on uh, I-4435 heading westbound and uh, I do want to point out that it has been, it's pretty slick out out here. It's been coming down not hard, but consistently all morning. So keep that in mind whenever you uh, get to where you're going this morning. Um, the rain is enough to stop MoDOT from doing some of their overnight work that they had scheduled. The ramp from westbound I-470 to northbound I-435 was supposed to be shut down for some crack sealing on the bridge. That work will start back in two days and continue for about a week so various ramps and bridges will be shut down overnight in the three trails crossing area and of course construction continues on the bigger 435 expansion project over here as well. MoDOT says four lanes will remain open throughout the duration of construction. Uh, you can see we're in the interlane inner lane right now that's open. There are three other lanes um, on the other side of that concrete barrier there that are open that we have access to the to the exits but they have hoping to have all 10 lanes um, on this area of interstate open by the end of the year. It will be completely operational. So the, the concept is to have a 10 lane fully functional, all the interchanges working uh, as they would in their final total configuration with some minor stuff to clean up come spring. Now about 155,000 vehicles drive through this area every day and the growth continues to increase that number. MoDOT says the Cerner facility itself has increased the traffic significantly, so the new concrete pavement in bridges is long overdue. We're reporting live in our mobile weather center, Leslie Aguilar, KCTV 5 News. All right, going to be a long road ahead. Thanks, Leslie.